Hey guys! Um, I thought I would do a video and just share with you um, the few things that I got my mother, um, mother-in-law, and two other people that are very special to me. I did not go all out. Like, you know how sometimes you watch these YouTube videos and they're just, it's a lot and then you want to make it, but then it's like the people that you're gifting it to is really is, they're not going to like it <laughs> but you know what I mean uh, this is going to be simple um, not expensive and super easy I probably won't even gift wrap any of these but maybe one maybe two um, but yes the first thing I got and I still haven't filled out cards or anything I went to Dollar Tree and grabbed just some cards and it says today every day always that's when you are loved happy Mother's Day just a simple little card and this is going to my um, mother-in-law she I was gonna get her flowers but she had already just went to like the flower garden nursery thing whatever you call it and bought like 20 flowers so I didn't want to do this but I came across this candle and it says best grandma ever so I will probably wrap this and put it in a little bag and I just think this is cute and that's going to her. Like I'm overdoing these big uh, feeling like I have to, you know, keep up with the Joneses or the Kardashians, whoever. And my um my daughter's grandmother, like on her dad's side, um I got this little rose thing and it says Happy Mother's Day. Super cute. I got this at Walmart and they're like a light pink and white together. Super cute. This was like $7 and something and I also just grabbed her a card. It says amazing woman, amazing mother because even though she is not my mother-in-law, I am very close to her. Um and it says that's you. Have a happy Mother's Day. Um, so those are for two different people. And this I just put together. Let me untie this real quick. Um, my daughter's aunt on her dad's side. Like I said, I'm really close to the family even though we're not together. So I wanted to make her a little thing. And she just had, she's got two little boys, a three-year-old and or soon to be three year old I'm sorry and um, she just had another little boy I'm not real for sure he's a few months old so I did just gather her up if you guys watch any of my videos you know I shop a lot I like to catch sales I have a gift tote well I have a gift closet that I have a bunch of stuff in so in her little goodie bag you guys remember way back I got these sets of body stuff so I got um, cherry blossom scented shower gel and lotion I took them out of the package so I could fit them in this bag and I don't want to touch the loofah but she's got a loofah let me set that right there and I also went to Dollar Tree again, to the normal one I usually go to, and I found a bunch of bath bombs. It came in a package of three. I don't have the package with me, but I took them out because it took up too much room. But I got her some cherry blossom bath bombs. And um, being a parent of two kids when your husband works all day or is gone out of town all the time, it's just... Uh, it's a lot. Okay, so I just figured she could take a nice bubble bath. She could do a face mask and um, another little face mask, a sheet mask. I'm sorry, a sheet mask and a face mask. And that's really all I got her. Figured she could soak in the tub and if she can get 10 minutes to relax, maybe that will help her do it. And I did get my mom a little bit more stuff just for the simple fact um, I see her every day it's my mom um, I do always get you know everybody something I do usually splurge a little bit more on my mom just because it is my mom I feel like if my husband was to splurge on his family then he should speak up and say something or do it himself <laughs> I hope that doesn't sound harsh um, but my mom 
my parents, like, they help us out a lot. If we ever need anything, um, we don't ha have to hesitate to ask, and they give it to us. So, like I said, I still didn't go extravagant, but I went and got her one of these flower pots with the, what are these things called? Uh, a hanging wire? Oh, wait, hold on. A coconut liner. <laughs> There's so many tags I couldn't find it. Um, I absolutely love this card. It says, love you, mom. Best mom. Happy Mother's Day. Today is not the only day I want to tell you how much I appreciate you, love you, and respect you, but it's really, but it's really a great excuse to make sure I do Happy Mother's Day. I just think it's super cute. I do love and appreciate my parent, my, both my parents, my mom especially, because she does a lot for me, but my mom likes to plant flowers, and when I say by, um, plant flowers. She is getting older, so she likes to get flowers that she doesn't have to like replant every year. And Walmart has a bigger variety, but I was at Dollar Tree to get that basket. And I have used Dollar Tree bulbs before, you guys. These do work. Mine grow back every single year. Every once in a while, you'll get one of these bulbs and it'll be dried up and no good. But I... I kill everything, and these always come back. But I got the yellow ones, the red ones, mixed ones, and those. I got those just because, like I said, she is getting older, and it's harder for her to, you know, have to replant flowers all the time. And speaking of that, I got her... I used one of these to um, bathe my son with um, so my knees don't kill me all the time. But I got her one so when she is weeding or planting or doing anything in the garden, she's got that to help her with her knees. I also got her some shearing things because she does love roses. And I was going to buy her a rose, but she bought herself like five of those roses I showed you and the bigger ones. So I'm not, I couldn't do that, but I got her those. I also bought her some gloves, and I figured since everything else was kind of purple, I would just stick with the purple theme. I have a pair of something like these from Dollar Tree, and I think I bought them like two years ago. I actually have a few pairs, and you guys, I love these. They grip the grass really good, and it pulls it out better than what, like, you would with your hand, and you don't get any, like, because I, I get cut by grass a lot, and that hurts. And I'm not as freaked out, like, weeding my flower bed. Because there's always bugs and stuff in there. I don't get freaked out if I have gloves on. I'll just stick my bare hand down in there. I, I'm a little iffy about it. But I got her some gloves. She also loves hummingbirds. I kind of wish I would have got like a prettier one. But this will do for now. Because she's got a bunch hanging around her porch. She's got like a covered porch all the way. Like almost all the way around her house. If that makes sense. And she has a bunch of feeders. And I did get this just in case if she didn't have any. I know you can make it at home with water, sugar, and food coloring. But I know she buys hers like pre-made in a jug. So I just went ahead and got that. She also loves wind chimes. She's got a bunch of them. So I thought this one was cute. I don't want to take it out of the package. You know what? Just one second and I will. You guys, I don't even know how to pause it on this phone. So, one day I might use a camera. I just, I dread to edit on the laptop, guys. Like, I skipped every day of my computer class when I was in high school. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I wish I would have bought myself one. Is that right? I don't know. I think it goes like that, but it needs pulled down. Anyway, there's that. This is super cute. I'm not for sure if I messed that up. There we go. I think it goes something like that, guys. But that is really cute, you guys. For a dollar, usually their wind chimes are like really crappy, but that is super pretty. I'm not going to open this one, but I also got her a flower one. Like This is what I mean by like cheaper looking. Um, but it's, it's cute, a flower, and then it's got, and then a big old diamond down there, and I also, this was the only, like, little Mother's Day plaque thing I could find, and it says, home is wherever you are, Mom, 
Oh, wait. Home is wherever your mom is. Happy Mother's Day. I cannot read today, you guys. It's it's noon, and I've been up since, like, 5.45. Um, but, yeah, I got her that, and like I said, I also got her a hanging basket because she likes these. But, you guys, that is everything that I got um, the mothers in my life. I don't know what I'm getting because I didn't buy myself anything this year. So, hopefully, my husband and my kids will step up and, you know, get me something. Um... A few people have brought me uh, fl hanging pots, flowers, whatever you call them. Anyway, you guys, my next video will go up Monday. It will be my small subscriber appreciation video. And I hope you guys have a happy Mother's Day. And I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.